Today we're gonna to be using AI to create some insane tattoo designs for my subscribers. The AI software we're gonna be using today is called Midjourney. Now it's through Discord, you can use it both on your phone and on your computer. If you're not familiar with photo generated AI, pretty much all you do is type whatever you want in and it will automatically, artificially create a design for you right then and there. Like if you wanted Shrek to be eating ice cream running on a rainbow road in the galaxy, yeah, you can make that. And real quick, this video is just for fun. By no means am I saying to use AI over going to a professional tattoo artist and having them create the design. By no means, always go for the professional tattoo artist. They know best and nothing's ever gonna top a human. But anyway, let's jump into the phone. You guys in the Evolve community sent me over a bunch of different tattoo ideas that you plan on getting. So let's see what the AI generated software creates for you. So Steffi said, planning on getting a Super Mario theme tattoo featuring Mario and Luigi and Toad with the, in the background, including Mario would be some iconic items like stars, mushrooms, planning on getting this on my lower leg. Well, let's type it in the mid journey and see what it comes up with. I'm first gonna just see what it comes up with just by copying and pasting your message. And then you add that in and now the mid journey bot is starting to create the image. So let's see what it comes up with. Dude, this is insane. So it automatically is starting to generate the AI for me, the AI picture, and I'm already seeing what it looks like and it's coming up with some crazy designs. So I didn't specify that it was gonna be on the lower leg, which I'm going to do in a second, but you could just see the power of this AI tool. But let's try to type it in to make it as a tattoo on the lower half of the leg. So I'm gonna copy and paste exactly what I just put in there, but then I'm gonna add lower leg sleeve. And there it is, holy crap. Dude, just remember, this is all artificially made. So it always gives you like four different options that you could choose from. But like some of these, like some of them aren't perfect. Everything else is like pretty damn awesome looking. And also on top of that, it literally frames and, and like puts the, puts the tattoo perfectly positioned on somebody's leg, which is actually really insane. Thank you so much for your submission. And if anybody that I get to in this video wants any of these pictures or tattoo designs, like as reference pictures, for example, just DM me on Instagram or in the comments right here and I'll send it over to you. Emilio is next and he wants a Night Fury symbol from How to Train Your Dragon on your left inner forearm. The top near the wings have electricity and the bottom half have fire to really make it pop. Sounds like you watch Evolve Inc and you know how to really structure your tattoo designs. So let's see what AI wants to create with this or can create with this. Same thing like we did before. I'm gonna do Imagine because that's what you gotta do to start creating the designs. And then we're gonna pop it in, literally just copy and paste in, and then bam. Now I know a little bit about how to train your dragon, but I don't know like anything about it in general, but I do recognize that face right there. That's like, I think it's toothless from, from how to train your dragon. It's, it's still processing right now, but whoa. Dude, these are absolutely crazy looking. Now at first glance, all of these look really awesome as tattoos and they'll all have really nice pops of color. I don't know how accurate it is to what you literally just typed into me and told me to put it into the software, but overall, they, these things look awesome. Now the positioning, see AI is not perfect. The positioning is, is a little off. I would add it a little bit more onto the forearm. It looks like it almost has it near like the elbow bend area. As you guys go along, it is giving us four different options. You and the Evolve community, pick which one is your favorite on each of these because I think that will be pretty fun too. This, this video is just fun in general, but this next name, I don't know if I can pronounce it, but they said, I would like to get a black and gray coyote head tattoo on my forearm. I would like it to have it look like it's sneaking up on prey through the woods. All right, say less, let's put it in the mid journey. Now, even though these designs are pretty awesome looking, I don't think that this is, you know, what you wanted. Now I said it before, AI is not perfect, but there is an option that you could do. Like you, if you hit this little recycling button, it will recycle the designs and kind of like come up with four new ones to see if it comes closer to what you want. So let's take a look. Wolves and coyotes do look similar. And I will say that majority of these designs do look like wolves. Uh, but man, this one is super awesome looking right here. Has the trees breaking out of like the sides and underneath the uh, the wolf's head. 
and it has like branches going through the wolf too and like these veins very unique i have not seen anything like this before and also black and gray with the color in the eyes gotta love it now their designs look pretty awesome but thank you so much for your submission and let's get on to the next one Oliver is up next, and he wants an Anubis holding an hourglass uh, with a person walking in the sand in the top part of the hourglass as a back piece. All right, let's see what it comes up with. Now, I am going to paste what you said, but I am going to add that it is going to be a tattoo back piece. Back piece tattoo. Just to give it some context. And wabam, send. Let's see what it comes up with. Just by the AI generating the pictures, I could already see that it's going to be a back piece, but let's take a look. It definitely looks like Anubis, but I will say that even though this one up at the top right is not technically a back piece, I feel like this is probably the coolest design out of the four. And I noticed that it also doesn't have a person walking on, uh, on the bottom like you said. So let's give it another reroll and see what it comes up with. Ooh. All right, these designs are even cooler than the last. Ah, eh, maybe. This this bottom one, it looks like it's on a shirt, not a back tattoo. See? AI's hey, not perfect. But yeah, these designs look pretty cool. It also looks like my dog's serious. Serious, it looks like you look. But Oliver, just what you told me alone when you were describing the tattoo you wanted, I feel like it's going to look like an awesome back piece. So when you go and actually get this thing done, definitely send over the results because I would love to see. But thank you so much for your submission. All right, Mason, so you're up next. I'm getting my first tattoo in two weeks. Congratulations. Uh, I want it to be the city of Philadelphia where I'm from. I'm from Philadelphia too, so let's go birds. So anything that represents Philly, like the buildings, Liberty Bell, Rocky statues, sports teams, etc. So let's see what it comes up with. I could already see some arms forming. I have a feeling that this tattoo or this design that the AI is gonna create is not going to be good, but let's be hopeful. Oh, wait a minute, hold on. I might be wrong. Yo, okay. Wow. Wow, I was wrong. These designs actually look pretty crazy. Now, that's clearly not the Eagles helmet, but you got like uh, the Philadelphia skyline. You got some uh, football helmet right there. It didn't add the Liberty Bell in from what I see, but man, for AI to just, you know, stand up and be like, yo, I'm gonna create this right quick for you. And it's cool because it's all like a bicep arm tattoo to where it's like, you have all that real estate to really just work with. So. All of, the, all of these designs will end up working really well for this. My expectations were down here for this design, but they, they look pretty damn good. Maybe this will give you some inspiration. Hopefully all these tattoos so far are giving you guys inspirations that are sending it in. I think I'm gonna stop there. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, be sure to subscribe, and thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.